What's up, guys? What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Nasai, and I'm back with another video. As you can tell from the title, I'm going to be doing a weekly vlog um technically it's weekly technically it's not this is just pretty much gonna be my intro but i'm going to show you all the film that i've done up up to this part and then i will y'all see it fall back in line okay um literally like i ended my contract for those of you who've been following me um know that i do travel phlebotomy and i just got finished in dallas texas and now i'm about to go to my next destination but i'm not going to reveal that just yet um but I've kind of decided that I'm going to be moving to my next destination, like, I think permanently. Um, but get excited for that video to come out. So definitely go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you guys can be updated and put that bell notification button on so you guys can be updated when I do post that video. Um, other than that, let's just kind of get right into this video. This video is pretty much going to be me packing, getting ready, um, me leaving from Dallas, Texas. Like, there's going to be scenes in here. But I've literally had to get a little done up or whatever before I kind of had to film. You know what I'm trying to say? But yesterday, um, which was the 1st, November 1st, today's the 2nd, obviously, um, I got my nails done and my eyebrows and everything like that done. And I'm going to be putting that into this clip. So without further ado, go ahead, like I said, like, comment, and subscribe. And let's just get right into this video. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Nasai, and I'm back with another video. Um, right now, currently, I am filming on my phone because I forgot my camera upstairs um but yeah welcome back guys it is another vlog if you are new to my channel go ahead and hit the subscribe button and let's get right into this video okay so today okay let's just start here okay my contract is finally over guys yes it is pretty much almost done kind of ish it's basically over i only have like three days left on my contract here in dallas and even though like i'm really 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 gonna miss the place that i'm working at because it's such a good place like i really have not experienced like you know the people is good the workload is amazing you know what i'm trying to say the supervisors are really like hands-on like i would literally come back here like 100 percent. okay Alrighty, guys so let's just lay this out flat it's like a bittersweet feeling right now like i am super super happy to go home and see my family but then again it's like i really love it here i love the atmosphere like dallas is like really a nice place i'm just feeling like okay i want to stay but then again it's like i'm ready for something new like it's time for that like i've been here for six whole months if i stay any longer like it's just gonna keep going you know so I, I've basically kind of made it to the point where it's like, you know, I've told my supervisors and everything like that, that I would literally like, um, come back. Like I've let them know, like, you know, I'll come back if you guys want me to, like, I don't have a problem with that. Like you guys have been so good to me, you know, like the whole nine yards, you feel me? Um, so hopefully they will definitely keep me as the person to call when it comes down to like me coming back and or if they need more people. I already know they started hiring more travelers. So, you know, at the moment they're straight, you know? And I just kind of feel like I'm ready for something new. Like I've already said before, like I already know where I'm going next and that will be in my next video. But um, basically to get to the point, today is the day where i am pretty much packing up getting myself pretty much straight i've literally like i know i have a lot of stuff but i've been pretty much taking care of myself like this last two weeks like you know packing up like most of my clothes like today we have like to wash clothes and stuff like that so i'm gonna wash everything and pretty much pack those stuff up devin got his car shipped back to florida uh, and in that stuff majority of the stuff like our crock pie um the thing big things you get what i'm trying to say that we brought here has been already shipped there so we're straight when it comes to that now now basically the only thing that we have to like pretty much carry is like our clothes and 
um like my lighting for like my you know my videos and stuff like that it's like not a lot but we're like slowly but surely you know chopping down and packing things up um today i have to um go get an oil change get my tires plugged and or sealed up um i do need to get my car clean but i'm gonna say that for devin for him to do <laughs> later and then i need new windshield wipers so that's pretty much on the agenda today literally it's not too much you know i'm just gonna come back home after i'm finished and pretty much going about it like that <sighs> so yeah so right now we are about to go to walmart first i'm gonna go ahead it's it's like 7 19 i think yes yeah, 7 19 it is october 26th um just in case i didn't say that already i don't know if i did <laughs> um but yeah right now i am about to go to walmart and go pick up the windshield wipers and anything else that i can probably possibly find um and then after that i'm gonna go get the oil change um but yeah let's just go ahead and get started you guys because time's of the essence and i really do not want to you know mess up anything when it comes to today because i really don't have the time or energy for it at all all right guys i hope you guys can kind of see me i really should have brought my other camera but it's okay um but yeah like i really want to tell you guys literally where i'm going but i know i can't but it's so exciting let's just say this that the place that i'm going i'm going to love it there because i already may or may not have been um and i plan on getting an apartment this time instead of staying in a hotel um one is because it's cheaper that way um for those of you who do kind of know about like the traveling and stuff like that you may know that when it comes to um traveling it's all about the pay package and how much they're giving you as well as how much the actual living is in that area and for this case the hotels like they're literally they i don't know if it's just the place that i'm going is just stingy when it comes to the prices but like the hotel i'm standing at now was like only 55 dollars 50 to 55 dollars or whatever a night which is really really good that's like literally only 1500 dollars a month and that's something that i was looking for but the place that i'm going is like literally 79 dollars like the whole shebang so i'm like uh-uh we finna stay in an apartment it's pretty nice um i already pretty much applied for the apartment i'm just waiting for them to like you know get back at me and like let me know what exactly i have to do in order to um finish the process and then once i hear back from them i'm going to basically just start moving stuff in and stuff like that so that is super exciting i'm trying to think if i want to like pretty much add that into this vlog or not no we're just gonna have like a separate video for that because i don't want it to be confusing for you guys and or that's just too much in one video so literally this video is going to be us packing up you know getting ready for us to go back to where i live in florida and then and or i might stop by i don't really know but we gonna figure it out okay guys <laughs>
what's up guys so hey right now it is november 2nd and it's 11 04 in the morning um i really am trying to figure out how i'm going to be doing this vlog i don't know if this is going to be my intro outro i don't know but what's up guys yeah <laughs> so it is november 2nd tuesday 11 04 and as you can kind of you can't really see but i am sitting on my floor right now Ooh, i hope i'm not ashy hold on hello I, um i have my little sister calling but so uh, basically i don't know if i don't really know like y'all this is hard for me i don't know exactly how i'm structuring these videos here but this vlog is basically about me moving <laughs> i am moving oh my god Alrighty, guys so right now it is november 2nd um it is tuesday it is 11 09 in the morning and i just got finished filming my clothing haul like i recently purchased a bunch of clothes because the next destination that i'm going to is pretty cold um if you guys want y'all can somewhat guess where i'm going down below if you guys would like to do that i will definitely play that game with you guys or you could check out my um new i don't even know what i'm saying y'all i'm like <laughs> lost for words right now but yeah so or you guys can check out or go to my social media and dm me whatever you guys feel like doing i'm good with that but the clothes that i just bought i'm basically packing those up literally i think yeah it was sunday i had went to my dad's house to be able to um pack up literally all my stuff i'm talking about like my pots and pans that i have from my apartment in orlando um like all the like mats and stuff like that like i literally packed that up and because bay devin is coming with me he has mad stuff too so i'm really trying to figure out if we're gonna drive two separate cars up there and just be done with that or drive my car and then ship his car like we really don't know what we're doing and this is like really confusing so yeah but again like right now i am literally packing up the clothes that i just took out and it's so freaking much y'all i literally i don't even know like i had too much even to start with and now that i've added more clothes to the bag it's like terrible um but i got so many cute pieces like this you guys like it's so freaking cute like i love this is i wouldn't yeah i wouldn't say this is my favorite clothing haul that i've done but there's a lot of pieces in this clothing haul that i have or that i did do that are really really cute so i would definitely recommend you checking that out um but i have so much other stuff to do like um i gotta finish packing um i gotta still sign my lease for the apartment like i'm so excited you guys so definitely be sure to stay updated with me because i'm gonna do like a you know apartment tour i'm gonna do like you know furniture shopping and stuff like that in the near future so definitely be ready for that um but yeah, I'm going to literally finish packing up these clothes and cleaning up this room. And I will check with you guys a little bit later. Um, I don't have that much film on my SD card either way. So I'm just going to do this and then, yeah. So see you guys later. Currently 2 16 in the afternoon. It is currently Friday, November 5th. And we literally we left this morning from Florida around like 5 a.m. and we're here. We got here around 12. But we've been I had to go get the money for the um apartment. I had to like get everything and we're like literally moving in. I wanna kinda literally it's just a studio, but I am super comfortable. Like it's super cute. It's like a whole new vibe. Like I'm really excited. Um Devin just went to get the rest of the stuff and we're gonna go to rooms to go next so i will kind of document that um but yeah guys i'm really just trying to get myself together here i'm super excited super you know just full of joy and like new adventures new beginnings to like a whole new vibe and yeah so just stay tuned um i know this video is like literally probably about to be like mad choppy and different different days between 
But I wanted to just do like one whole vlog from the point where I ended my contract from Dallas till me coming here to Atlanta and you know, just getting in with it. So bear with me, <laughs> um, but we about to get right back into it, okay? Alrighty guys, so this is the video. This is my front door, people. Um, this is like some type of unit. I hope I can show you guys, yeah. This is like a unit, some type of unit. I don't know what that is. Space heater, water heater, something like that. Let me turn my light off for you guys, so you guys can kind of see. So as you go in, this is gonna be our washer and dryer. Boop, boop. Let me get, oops, turn off my light to save water. I mean, lights. This is gonna be my kitchen. It's pretty cute. We still gotta step, you know, get stuff together and stuff like that. I honestly don't know if that's paint or if it's just supposed to. I think that's probably like, you know, where they cover up stuff. I don't know, but that's a little closet. It's pretty chill. That's how I know for a fact I'm going to need a dresser. Like, literally. Um, but yeah, that. This is the bathroom. It's kind of cute. I like it. And yeah. And that's really the end of the tour. Um, but stay tuned till next week. And I will definitely show you guys other stuff. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is currently November 9th, I think. I'm on my way to my contract. Yep. Literally right now, I am on my way to the contract. I'm super, super psyched right now. Like, literally, I'm so happy, so excited. Like, it's like a good feeling. Like, I, I really do love um, starting new contracts because it's like, it's just you in a new city. Like, you're gonna meet new people. Like, a different experience. So like it's just a whole different vibe, and I'm excited to see and experience. Slide. I'm excited to see the new experiences that it um, Atlanta has to offer for me. Um, it's just yeah, like I'm just super psyched right now. Um, so basically, this morning um, I am about to literally head there, and also I gotta get you already know I gotta get my music in. If you guys can see, I'm listening to "Breathe" by Michael W. Smith. I literally love him. I love under music that. Lights, turn left onto Lennox Road North. East. Okay, girl. Okay, I'm coming. I literally have to like literally get my mind right, body, mind, soul, spirit, everything. I gotta be prayed up. You know, when you're new in a new territory, you really gotta protect yourself and guide yourself through it. And definitely, God is that individual that does that for me. I need His divine protection and healing and. If you know, you know, you know, so starting early, bright in the morning, get your music going, you know, and just handle your business. And that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to worship and literally head there this morning for breakfast. Literally, I drink some green tea. You already know, like I love my green tea, but also I got me a Whole Foods 100% um, cold pressed juice, rise and shine. Literally $6.99 at Whole Foods. I literally need to get me a freaking juicer because this whole purchasing a 699 juice when I could easily do it myself like I could purchase a 299 watermelon and juice that and be so satisfied um but I'm definitely going to be looking into that I know Amazon got lots of juicers on there especially for like a really good price uh, in half a mile turn right to merge onto state route 400 north so yeah let me literally pay attention to this hero so I do not get lost and I'll catch you guys back later bye bye This is the air I breathe. What's up, guys? What so it is currently, I don't even know. It is Friday, and I think it's like 7 in the afternoon. <sighs> Y'all. So, right now, Devin is over there cooking. And I'm just chilling pretty much. I'm just waiting. Um, I think my friend's gonna stop by so we can say hey to each other. But other than that, I'm probably gonna go to bed tonight. I wanna explain to you guys, but I'm gonna wait. So tomorrow I'm planning on getting my hair done. So hopefully that all goes through. Um and I'm gonna explain it explain a couple other things too as well tomorrow. But I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you guys know that so far the job is pretty much going pretty well. 
and I'll add to that a little bit more. But it's been hard for me to really film because I'm so tired and I've been having to do so much, you know, with moving and everything like that. Um, I'm really just exhausted, like waking up at 1.30 and having to go in at 3 and everything like that. Um, but we're getting it and we're getting it together and yeah. Good morning, guys. Welcome back. <laughs> um, today is November 13th. It is 6.11 in the morning. I got up around like 5 something and took a shower and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so today I plan on getting my hair done um, by an old friend that I used to know back in high school. Especially since I'm back in Atlanta now, like I know like certain people, whatever, kind of, kind of. Um, but yes, so today I'm about to get my hair done. Um, but I had to, she said I had to um, have it straightened out or blow dried out and stuff like that. So that's what I'm about to do. Um, the appointment's at nine o'clock and I still gotta pick up the hair. So we got a lot to do. Um, and because it is a 6 11 right now, like I don't wanna run late. So that's what we're about to do. Alrighty guys, so we are on our way to this place where I'm supposed to get my hair done at. Um, it is currently 10, no, it is currently 9.40. Um, we literally are running a little bit late, but everything is pretty much pretty straight. I think it should take like an hour, hour 30 maybe, the most. I don't got that much hair, and my hair is really thin, so when it comes to like, you know, easily braiding and everything like that, it's... It should be fine. Hopefully she will allow me to film. I'm not sure, like I really don't know how people feel when it comes to doing that. Um, but if she does allow, I'll try to get some clips in there. If not, y'all already know the deal. Y'all see, well y'all will see the um, results and ending. So stay tuned for that. to the house um as you can tell the hair is looking pretty good probably going to rock it like this literally the whole time um so here's a clear view of it so first and foremost it looks straight to me i mean personally i definitely wish that it was a lot longer and thicker um but i'm not even going to complain because i know going to those covid rooms i'm going to be having to tie my hair up and honestly, if it was thicker than this, yes, I could have put it in the bun, but it probably would have been really heavy on my head. So, I think this is fine. Just like this, it's straight. It's something to do, honestly. I'm just doing this really to be able to have my hair done so that I can easily just wake up and go and not have to worry about anything or anybody or nothing at all and still look presentable. So, yeah. Um, that's that on that. Um, overall, so far, like, I'm really... I'm not gonna say that I love the place because the last place that I left from, like the other contract in Texas, I love that place. Like it was clean, it was it was a lot to do, but there was a lot of phlebotomists there to help pick up the weight of the amount of work that needed to be done. Um, the place here, um, they need more people. <laughs> And yes, they hired me, but they still need more people. I feel like they need at least like two or three more people, like for night shift and then also for day shifts. Um, so that's the only real bad thing. But other than that, like the workload is not that much, honestly, truly. Like once you do morning runs, you may 
have to do 40 one and run and then after that and maybe like two or three which is normal you know after that but tomorrow is like my real official like first day and honestly truly like i'm ready for it i'm ready to get it over with because then after that i have monday thursday friday monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday off and then again i i mean no monday tuesday wednesday thursday off so i have my um four days off and then three days on and obviously y'all know i work only weekends um i think i told you guys that <laughs> honestly i don't even know but yeah so i work only weekends and honestly truly i'm straight with it this is like i'm not really gonna be able to hang out over the weekend you know because i know i'm not doing nothing after work then 12 hour shifts really be kicking my behind i really don't like 12 hour shifts but in order for me to be where i'm at right now <laughs> i gotta do it um and honestly i feel like they already talking about extending me so or extending in general so yeah guys i'm really happy with like just everything like um um, personally, as many of you may already know that I have already like moved, like officially moved back to Atlanta. Um, and that honestly is the plan. I mean, I feel like it's straight out here. And I honestly, I feel like it just honestly depends on where you live in at in Atlanta. Um, certain parts I just feel like are not meant to be lived in. You know, or you may get like a certain feeling passing through certain areas. And that one thing, that's something that like I really just don't like. But the area that I'm in, I feel like I, it's decent. You know what I'm trying to say? Like I really like it. It's clean. <laughs> and honestly, I'm definitely going to show you guys like also an apartment tour. Um, once I get everything finished and all my furniture, we already got our bed set up and stuff like that. But I still got a dresser and get some couches and, or a couch and like a little mini dining room table. Um, and then I'll show you guys after that. After we get everything in, we'll show you like a whole, whole tour. But again, um, so right now I'm about to go make me some food. Um, I really want to take a bowl bath. I think I really deserve it, honestly, truly. But I don't got no cow on. Um little stuff that makes it like really fuzzy and like bubbly and stuff like that. I don't got no bath bomb. I don't got nothing. Um, other than soap and water. <laughs> um, we'll do it about this scrub, but still. Yeah, so I may think about going out late a little bit in a few minutes to go and get one of those. If not, I'll probably just take a regular bath, bubble bath and do it like that. I'll probably like steam some herbs um, to be able to like, you know, put into my bubble bath. And just honestly relax because your girl is really like I've been ripping and running like every single day I go out. I have not, I've yet to have a day where I can just actually have to myself and pretty much just chill. Right now I am definitely probably about to get me some food. Um, honestly don't really know. I got some vegan lasagna. That's what I do that. And some pancakes. That's the best. That's really the best. So I'm gonna make me some vegan lasagna. It says, um, I think gluten free too, yeah, which is good. Dairy free, gluten free is the best way to go, honestly, truly. So I'm about to do this and some of these mini crab cakes. I love this stuff. You throw a little bit of hot sauce on it, and it's too good. Um, and that's honestly what I'm about to eat. But I'm about to change out of these dirty clothes, wash my hands, and pretty much get ready to chill a little bit. And I'll catch back with you guys a little bit later. Alrighty guys, so it is currently 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, that bubble bath did not happen, but I sure tore up that lasagna and those crab cakes. Literally, I ate it all. Um, but now I am really tired. Um, I'm about to probably just go ahead and take a shower and get ready for bed. Because um, I do have to wake up at 4 a.m. No, really 3 a.m. to get there at 4 because it's from 4 to 4. Um, but I think next week i will probably try and do the bubble bath situation you guys will probably see that in my next vlog but that is the end of this vlog thank you guys so much for watching and staying to till the end i really appreciate you guys so again don't forget to like comment and subscribe and until next time bye